planning a trip to the Maldives, wondering when to go, where to eat, how to save money and more, well you're in the right place. This is your comprehensive guide to everything Maldives. Over the course of this video, we're going to dive into the best months to visit this tropical paradise, discuss why the Maldives should be your next holiday destination, and explore the local weather patterns. We'll also share insider tips on how to save money while enjoying all that the Maldives has to offer. We'll delve into the rich culture and customs of the Maldivian people, recommend tantalizing local dishes to try, and guide you on getting around the islands with ease. We'll even cover the entry and exit requirements for a hassle-free journey, so buckle up and get ready for a deep dive into the Maldives. Stay tuned as we unravel the magic of the Maldives and help you plan your dream vacation. Why choose the Maldives, you ask? Well, let's dive in. The Maldives is a treasure trove of unique experiences. Imagine waking up to the breathtaking view of turquoise waters right outside your overwater bungalow. Picture yourself strolling down the sandy white beaches, with the sun kissing your skin. The Maldives isn't just about lounging on the beach, though. It's a haven for water sports enthusiasts, offering everything from snorkeling to surfing and even jet skiing. And if you're a fan of marine life, you're in for a treat. The Maldives boasts a rich underwater ecosystem, teeming with colorful coral reefs and a plethora of aquatic creatures. But it doesn't end there. The Maldives is also home to luxury resorts that offer world-class amenities, ensuring your stay is nothing short of spectacular. So, whether you're a thrill seeker, a nature lover, or a luxury traveler, the Maldives has something for everyone. In the Maldives, every day is a tropical paradise. Timing is everything, especially when planning a trip to the Maldives. Now, if you're looking for the best weather, you'll want to aim for the dry season, which runs from November to April. The skies are clear, the sun is bright, and the seas are calm, perfect for all those beachside activities. Now, if dodging the crowds is your priority, consider May to October. Yes, it's the rainy season, but the showers are usually short-lived, and you'll have more of the islands to yourself. Plus, the prices are generally lower during this period, so it's a win-win. For those seeking the best of both worlds, the shoulder months of November and April could be your sweet spot. You'll get the pleasant weather of the dry season and avoid the peak tourist rush. Remember, every month has its charm in the Maldives, whether it's sun-soaked December or a tranquil August. So take your pick and mark those calendars. Dreaming of a budget-friendly Maldives trip? It's possible! First up, let's talk accommodation. While the Maldives is famous for its luxury resorts, you don't have to break the bank for a place to rest your head. Opt for local guest houses instead. They're often family-run, giving you an authentic experience of Maldivian hospitality. Plus, they're a fraction of the cost of those swanky overwater bungalows. And let's face it, you're here for the beaches and the sea, not to stay cooped up in your room, right? Next, let's tackle food. While resort dining can be a treat, it can also eat up your budget faster than you can say past the lobster. Instead, try eating at local restaurants. You'll find a variety of dishes bursting with flavor, from spicy curries to fresh seafood, all at a much more palatable price. And don't forget those bustling local markets, a treasure trove of fresh fruits, veggies, and local delicacies. Now, on to transportation. The Maldives is an archipelago of 26 atolls, which means getting around can be a bit tricky. But fear not, public ferries are your best friend here. They're reliable, they offer some of the best views around, and best of all, they're cheap. So why not take the scenic route and save some money while you're at it? Last but not least, consider booking your trip during the off-peak season. Not only will you avoid the crowds, but you'll also find that prices for flights, accommodation and activities are often significantly lower. Just remember to check the weather forecast before you book. You don't want to swap sunbathing for monsoon dodging. So there you have it. A few simple tips to help you save some pennies on your dream trip to the Maldives. Remember, a little planning goes a long way. With these tips, you can enjoy the Maldives without breaking the bank. Immerse yourself in the rich culture and customs of the Maldives. This tropical paradise is not just about the sun, sea and sand. It's also about a unique culture that's been shaped by centuries of seafaring, trade and religious practices. The Maldivians, known as Divahin, are warm and welcoming people. They value family and community, which is evident in their close-knit island communities. A handshake is a common greeting, but remember, use your right hand as the left is considered impure. 
Religion plays a vital role in Maldivian society. Islam is the state religion and is deeply woven into everyday life. Modesty is key when it comes to clothing. So, while bikinis are perfect for the resort's beaches, more conservative attire is appreciated in local islands. The Maldivian language, Divehi, with its unique script, is another cultural marvel. You might not master it, but learning a few phrases can surely win you some smiles. Remember, respecting local customs enhances your travel experience. Ready to tantalize your taste buds with Maldivian cuisine? Let's dive in. Maldivian cuisine is a tropical delight that reflects the heart of the Indian Ocean. The first dish you must try is Mas Huni. It's a traditional breakfast food, a scrumptious mix of finely chopped tuna, onions, coconut and chili. It's like a morning hug for your palate. Next up is Biskimia. Imagine a delicate spring roll filled with lightly spiced onions, cabbage and hard-boiled eggs. It's the perfect beach snack, especially when paired with a refreshing coconut water. And let's not forget the Maldivian curry. Rich with coconut milk filled with fresh catch of the day and spiced with a unique blend of Maldivian flavors, it's a dish that dances on your tongue. These are just a few highlights of the Maldivian cuisine. There's a multitude of flavors waiting for you here. Bon appetit, or as the locals say, Bajahi Veri Hendune. Navigating the Maldives is an adventure in itself. The Maldives, an archipelago of over 1,000 islands, has its unique and exciting ways of getting around. Let's start with speedboats, the Maldivian equivalent of a city taxi. Speedboats are a thrilling way to zip between nearby islands, perfect for those seeking a bit of adrenaline with their commute. Next up, we have the humble ferry. Ferries form the backbone of inter-island travel in the Maldives, offering a slower but more relaxed journey. It's a fantastic opportunity to sit back, enjoy the turquoise waters and maybe spot a dolphin or two. But for the ultimate Maldivian travel experience, nothing beats a seaplane. Imagine soaring above the atolls, the islands like jewels scattered in a sea of blue. It's not just a way to get around, it's an unforgettable experience. So whether you're zipping around on a speedboat, cruising on a ferry or soaring in a seaplane, remember whether by sea or air, getting around the Maldives is part of the fun. Before you pack those bags, let's talk about entry and exit requirements. Navigating visa policies can seem as complex as a coral maze, but fear not. The Maldives offers a 30-day visa on arrival for all nationalities, free of charge. Just ensure your passport is valid for at least six months from your date of entry. Now, about those necessary documents. Along with your passport, you'll need a confirmed booking for accommodation and enough funds to cover your stay, or a return ticket. Remember, it's sun, sand and no stress. As for customs regulations, the Maldives is quite strict. Prohibited items include alcohol, pork products and religious materials offensive to Islam. Also, don't even think about taking home any seashells or sand as souvenirs. That's a no-no. With the right preparation, your Maldives trip will be smooth sailing from start to finish. That's all folks, you're now ready to plan your Maldives adventure. With the tips we've covered, you're all set to explore this tropical paradise at the right time of year, soaking in the sun and the culture, all without breaking the bank. Remember, the Maldives isn't just about the plush resorts and stunning beaches. It's a place rich in history and traditions, a place where you can savor the unique flavors of Maldivian cuisine and navigate through the islands with ease. Just don't forget about the entry and exit requirements. And of course, there's so much more to discover in the Maldives. Each island offers its own slice of heaven, each view more breathtaking than the last. So pack your bags and get ready for an adventure of a lifetime. Safe travels. May your Maldives trip be as enchanting as a sunset over its crystal clear waters.